Hey guys, today we're gonna play some Mario. Now for people who don't know what this is, it's pretty much just Mario with like a twist to it. Yeah, I'll just show you. And uh, I've already played it a bit, so let's just start with World War. Oh gosh, does it ever lag? Now, uh, hold on. Uh, now, here's the twist. You can go like that, and then like that. Now watch this. Yeah. Then you can just get by. Now, not to diss the game, but this doesn't exactly have to be a game, but that's the point of indie games. They don't have to be games, they're just there. Oh. Well, there's not really much to say about this game, but... Check it out, it's free to download, um, I'll put the link to the website in the description for this game. They also do a bunch of other indie games, like I know, I know they have like a screwed up version of Tetris, they have Rock Band for the PC, yeah Rock Band for the PC, you never thought you'd see that. <laughs> And then now here's where the portal really helps. Ah oh, yeah, 800 points every time. Okay, hold on, I'll be right back and I'll show you the rest of the stuff. Okay, we're back, and now we're gonna play some portal levels. Wow! Portal and Mario! Well, I still remember how to pick up stuff. Boots, you can go do something to yourself. I got Mario now. <laughs> portal physics and Mario? Mario physics and portal. Oh. The best part is you're not timed. Now, just to point something out here, it doesn't lag like this in the real game. It's just because I'm using Bandicam that it does this crappy lag thing. So, uh, yeah. Light beams. Oh, oh. And that's how you die.
And that's where I'm going to end it. See you next time. Bye.